Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I'm the king and welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are having a fantastic day. I'm back, had a little bit of a mini vacation and we are back to the grind. Talking about Dead by Daylight, new stuff coming on into the game, new information, new updates, things like that. We're going to go ahead, jump on straight on into this. So, first of all, we have a release date for the new chapter. The new chapter is going to be released on the 8th. So literally on Tuesday, we're going to be getting this new chapter one week from today. It's going to be really, really awesome. And um, yeah, we're going to have the graphical update coming out with this and the new survivor, the new killer, new skins, new chase music, everything like that. In fact, Dead by Daylight have even put out a post showcasing how the graphics have been updated, how the graphics have been changed. I'm going to play that video for you guys right now. Now, as you can see, this is pretty much what we played in the PTB, but obviously everybody doesn't get a chance to play the PTB. Only players on Steam are allowed to do so. Because of this, they decided to make this post. And in addition to this, as you guys know, if you've been keeping up with the news of, you know, computer hardware, the 3000 series of graphic cards for NVIDIA have been released. And with this, we are seeing insane numbers of, you know, superbly great graphics cards. And... This can go hand in hand with Dead by Daylight, which, you know, ray tracing and 4K gameplay and things like that. In fact, in fact, even on the post, they said that DVD is confirmed to be coming out for next gen consoles and you'll be able to play DVD in 4K at 60 FPS, which is absolutely insane. You know, with the graphical update and everything coming out, obviously they would have to, you know, move up to play on 4K and then actually having that being standard 4K 60 FPS on the new consoles, obviously going to be coming to PC as well, is mind blowing. DVD is going to look absolutely amazing. And how cool would it be to play with like ray tracing in a game like DVD with these new NVIDIA cards? It would be absolutely mind blowing. In addition to that, we also received some new information. If you take a look on screen right here, we have some new information if you go over to the news section and in the news section it says we are now increase the tick rate of the game from 30 to 60 seconds players positions in game will be communicated with the server twice as often providing more accurate hits for a fair gameplay experience now this is going to iron out all of those hits that people are like hey how did that hit that one shouldn't have hit me it doesn't make sense and this game is broken we need better hitboxes we need better latency this is essentially going to put a fix to that dbd actually tweeted out a picture showing all of these changes that we're going to be getting so you guys can see that on screen right now and of course i have a chart as well which doesn't give much information but in case you don't understand long story short as i said it's going to send information to the server twice as much meaning instead of just skipping things think about it like 30 fps versus 60 fps instead of skipping frames it'll give you a smoother vision essentially and communication to the server making your hits look a lot more smoother because then it can accurately depict if the killer actually connects with the survivor or was that just because on the killer screen they're connecting with the survivor 
it's gonna be really really awesome to see that i also want to talk to you guys about some free blood points now obviously entity please and entity displease were the codes that were used you could have got 150,000 blood points and you could also got a one blood point if you use entity displease there is another code to get 150,000 blood points. However, I'm not going to share that code with you guys right now because Dead by Daylight are doing an incentive. And in the incentive, all you would need to do is to go ahead and go and join their Discord. The code will be there. You can then go and use that code. Get yourself 150,000 blood points or absolutely nothing. And that's pretty much it. So go ahead and join their Discord. I'll leave the link down below. And if I do forget, it'll be on their Twitter. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is pretty much all of the information that we received as of now. We got a lot more leaks for cosmetics and things like that, but I wanted to put out a video just recapping everything that I missed over the few days and just get you guys up to speed in case you missed anything. With that being said, we're going to go ahead and end off today's video here. Shout out to the Patreons and shout out to everyone subscribing and helping us in our race to 100,000 subscribers. Much appreciated, everyone. And as always, I'm the King. I took my crown to you guys, and we'll see you in the fall.